Welcome everybody, welcome to Bourbon on the Bayou, where I, your host Chris, will be sampling bourbons I have purchased and recently, oh, and you, you done? You, 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 you want to just want to sniff the song? By the way, all these takes are all done with one take, no editing, because I don't know how to do any of that stuff. But you know what I know how to do? Drink bourbon and get getting cold. All right, so, all right, enough of the ridiculousness. Um, what I recently purchased, I purchased a lot of bourbon since the last time I put a video out, which as when I looked was like um, three months ago, might be up to four now, because I've been really busy, and um, I decided to, you know, start putting some more out again. Why not? It's fun. Yeah. Just get to drink some bourbon on the camera, get to give some opinions and whatnot. And uh, so one of the ones I got recently is a... Heaven Hill, seven-year bottling bond, which I had to get, I had to mail order for this because my uh, area doesn't carry it. No place in my area carries this. I have to mail order it because I've been wanting to get a bottle of it to try. And uh, I just got today, I cracked it earlier, poured like a downside of it. Uh, just, just lay down, girl. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Okay, just don't go knock over the camera. Right, walk around the camera. That's it. Good girl. So, let me give this bad boy a try. See what it feel, tastes like. All right. So, actually, I really do like Heaven Hill products. McKenna, EH, um, Elijah Craig. Uh, some of my favorites. But so far, you know, pretty bourbon color to it. Got that amber color. Mm, the legs are all right, but not, you know, not really that great. But who gives a fuck about legs and color? We're here, we're here to drink the bourbon. So, uh, mm. no, I won't lie. I get some smells off of bourbon, but I'm not the, I don't have the greatest nose there is when sniffing to get a lot of aromas. You won't, you won't see me going, hmm, hints of caramel and toffee, marzipan. Oh, is that, is that a passion fruit part of the I smell? No, no, not me. No, you would never hear that shit. I get like, yeah, I get like a candy, like a toffee, and that's pretty much it, like all stuff. But this smells really good. Mm. Probably, probably help my nose if I didn't have like all these cats around. But anyway, enough about my felines. Uh, let's get back to the bourbon. Yeah, so uh, here we go. Cheers. Mm. Nice, sweet. Oh, uh, very sweet, very um, very vanilla toffee onto it, on the flavor. Mm. Got some good, uh, good, good oak on the back end. Really nice. Coats the palate really well. My tongue, I'm getting that effervescent, like that numbing feeling. I always describe it as like eating a shitload of fucking, uh, eating a shitload of uh, Listerine strips. It just numbs your tongue out. I really enjoy that. That feeling a lot, and I'm getting a lot of that off of this one. Finish is still light, lingering around for a while too. Like uh, another Happy Hill product, I uh, I seem to be enjoying here. You know, for a hundred proof, it's a hundred proof brought bottle and bond. That uh, finish is lingering for a while. Let's go for another sip. See what we get. See if we can find anything more on here. Mm. That one I got like a lot of, uh, mm, ooh. Not a bit. that one got like a lot of confection and sugar flavor on it too right there. Now, um, I really don't, I'm not sure what this goes for MSRP on this. I know I paid, I want to say either $49 for this or $59. Some of that ballpark area because like I said, I had to order it online. You know, though. I was trying to order one bourbon, and I saw this was on sale, so I'm like, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and buy this, too. So it wasn't too expensive, along with the shipping. Shipping for the place I got it from, like, fucking $18. I couldn't believe how cheap it was for two bottles. But anyway, uh, where I got this? Oh, yeah, I got this. Uh, if, if you want to go to the site I got this from, I'm, I'm not advertising for nothing, but it, it, it came pretty, if, of all the bourbon I've ordered from, uh, it came to quick. It was, like, four days. It was, like, Main Street Liquor I got it from, and 
Yeah, you know, like I said, I'm not advertising anything for them. Just they like, got pretty quickly, and uh, they do have a sale on it, and some other stuff and whatnot. But anyway, uh, yeah, I, I would recommend buying this. It tastes pretty. It's pretty good uh, bourbon right here. I'd recommend that. Really, really good. You know. Now, for the price, uh, what I really want to do is after let it get some air in it, I really want to put it against a uh, taste against like, like uh, some of the price range, like a uh, uh, 1920 or a um, Rare Breeze. See how, it, see how it stands up. But, you know, by itself, this is a, this is a pretty decent bourbon right here. And I would recommend it. I wouldn't, I wouldn't pay over the, if I, if I pay, if I remember right, if I pay $59.99, I wouldn't, I wouldn't pay more than that for it. But anyway, uh, uh, if you uh, like what you see, hit the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. And, uh, you know, till next time, deuces.